Hi there guys, hope you're well. Um, I've recently had some problems with picture messaging and MMS messaging from Virgin on my new Nexus 4. Um, I struggled to get an answer for this on the internet so what I'm going to do is just talk you through how I managed to fix it um, and hopefully for some of you this will help. So um, the first thing that you guys need to do on your Nexus 4 is go to your settings. So we need to go to your settings which is this one here and when you're in your settings we need to find more and then go to mobile networks. When you're in mobile networks the APN is the thing that you need. APN is your access point names. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, now mine was on T-Mobile for some reason and I don't know why it was on T-Mobile so the first thing you need to do is select Virgin Media um, that will that's your access point name when you go into Virgin Media the settings that I had were Virgin Media the APN is go to .virginmobile.uk there isn't a proxy set there's no port number set um, username is user the password is not set, the server was not set. Um, the MMSC details were http colon forward slash forward slash mms dot virgin mobile dot co dot uk eight zero zero two and my proxy number was different from the ones that I found on the internet. I didn't change it, I left it there. Um, and the MMS port is 8080, 8080. Um, the MCC wasn't on the internet, I kept that at 234. The MNC 30, which I didn't um, change. The thing I did change is down here on authentic, I can't even say the word, authentication type. Um, mine was set at PAP, so whatever one of these is, one or the other might not be right. So I selected both, either or. Um, once you've selected both of those, keep going down to the APN type. I didn't change this, so I've kept that default, comma, SUPL, comma, MMS. The APN protocol for me was IPv4. I changed that to both because I wasn't sure which one might be holding it back. Um, and the roaming protocol I changed again which again was IPv4 and I changed that to either 4 or 6. Um, now once I'd done that, I came out of that and there's a bearer as well which was unspecified. APN, I enabled that, um, which there isn't actually an option on mine at the moment to do that. So the first thing that I did do um, was I sent a picture message to someone um, I would suggest that you guys send a picture message to someone as well um, to try and activate the settings that you've got on your phone um, or, and once you've done that ask someone to send you a picture and see if that helps. I hope that's been helpful for some of you. Um, Virgin Mobile didn't have any details of the Nexus 4 settings on their system, they didn't actually have any details of Nexus 4 on the system at all. Um, so hopefully in the future they will sort that out. But until then, um, if that doesn't help you guys, all I can suggest is keep searching the internet because I, I struggled as well. Um, but hopefully for some of you that, that will help. Um, take care guys and hope that's helped. Bye bye.